How y'all doing? I'm Justin Wild. I'm from Bitten, Arkansas. Today we're going to go over something very spectacular, very something very amazing. It's the voice of the Lord through the numerical pattern of the Bible. So today we're going to go over threes today for direction. Uh, you'll see a lot of threes in this life because there's a lot of millions of people who need God's direction. So for instance, we're going to start with the Bible first though. Uh, you, you always start with the Bible because that's where it all started. So, so three for direction. God wants you to be directed to Him, G-O-D, or I am, I-A-M. Now, He directs you to Him by the author of the verse in the chapter, Old Testament poetry, New Testament, or the main one that directs you to God is the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Okay, guys? Now, the Holy Ghost is the third one in line because He is our direction. He, he directs us to God because He's the Lord of righteousness. He leads us into direction, to righteousness, guys, down the path of righteousness. See, but but then there's many different lives and testimonies all over the Bible that consist of this number three being direction. So you got Noah entered the ark with three sons, and Abraham he saw where to sacrifice Isaac on the third day, or Moses he was hit for three months, and Jonathan he shot three arrows for David's direction, and Mordecai and Esther fasted three days and three nights, or, or, or Jonah was in the belly of the well three days and three nights, and it took him three three days to go to Nineveh. Uh, you got, you know, all the way down to Joshua. It took three days to cross the Jordan. You got Joseph interpreted the butler, baker, and Pharaoh's dream. And the butler's dream was three branches, three days. And the baker's dream was three baskets, three days. Okay, guys. You got Jesus and the three crosses, three nails that hung him, three names above him. He rose on the third day. He went through life, death, and resurrection. He preached the gospel for three years. And he got crucified at the age 33. All right, guys. It goes all the way back to the Garden of Eden. It was God, Adam, and Eve. God stepped away. It was Adam, Eve, and the serpent. Okay? God, G-O-D, knew that man, M-A-N, and Eve, E-V-E, -E, would sin. S-I-N. So he sent his son, S-O-N, to die on the cross, which is one, two, and the Savior makes three. Okay? It started all the way back then, and, and it keeps going to this day. So Hebrews 13, 8 says, Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. So what he did back then, it's safe to say he still does this day, guys. And in the same pattern, with the same number. So, we're going to show you how God never changes, guys. Through the eyes of the Spirit who showed me how to show you. <laughs> Alright, so you got bidding truck sales. Alright. Let's get a little closer to it. Alright. So you got bidding truck sales. Ready? Bidding truck sales, that's direction to the business. Four changes you, okay? So we'll go there here in a minute. But bidding truck sales, three trucks, and you got a three prefix number starting off with three digits. So that's a lot of threes. Then it's in three sections. You see, guys, you see how God never changes? He never changes. His patterns never change. What you're seeing there is, is Hebrews 11, 3. Uh, the worlds were framed by the Word of God. The Word of God is the third one in command. Uh, so everything is in a, a numerical sequence of three, meaning the likeness image of the Holy Spirit. You see what I'm saying? Uh, before changes, so God changed the man and they wrote four Gospels. Uh, you got Samson got tempted three times by Lila, but that fourth time he changed back to regular man. He told us true powers. You got the four horsemen of the apocalypse going to change the world as we know it. So that's been trucksales.com. That's the business, but .com changes you to the website. Say how it's numerical pattern lines up to every single sequence, guys. Y'all have a beautiful day. I'm sorry for how loud it is, but the spirit moved me to do this one on the side of the freeway over here to show y'all how God never changes. How he only changes the four seasons to show you that he never changes, guys. Y'all have a beautiful day. God bless you.